Today's Daily Bible Thought begins what may be a week about not being afraid. Now, that could change if you answer my question about, do you have any questions? So if people send me messages or put comments on that Instagram post and have questions about the Bible, then I'll save my other fear not verses for another time. But for today, this is from Exodus. So if you've never read Genesis and Exodus, they're exciting books. There's a lot happening in those. The whole Old Testament is full of exciting stories. And you guys may or may not have heard of Moses, but when Moses led the people of Israel out of Egypt, they'd been slaves in Egypt for hundreds of years. When he took them out, they were coming out and Pharaoh's army was coming after them. And, and the Israelites got to the Red Sea, big Red Sea, uncrossable. And they're standing there and they're looking back. The Red Sea's in front of them. Pharaoh's armies are behind them and they were freaking out. And they're like, wouldn't it have been better just for us to have died in Egypt as slaves rather than come out here, bring us out here in the desert to die, just out here in the nowhere? And they were just upset and afraid, obviously fearing for their lives. But Moses, in tune with God, and knowing that God was going to make a way for them, you need to read the rest of that story to find out what he does with the Red Sea. Moses says in Exodus chapter 14, verses 13 and 14, but Moses told the people, don't be afraid, just stand still and watch the Lord rescue you today. The Egyptians you see today will never be seen again. The Lord himself will fight for you. Just stay calm. And I need to hear that word a lot. There are so many times where I'm afraid of different things, afraid of what might happen, afraid of what somebody might think, afraid of saying the wrong thing, afraid of not saying the right thing. I don't know, afraid of a lot of stuff. We're all afraid. And God wants us to stay calm. He wants to fight for us. And interestingly enough, the term, the phrase, do not be afraid, appears 70 times in the Bible in the New International Version. And phrases like fear not and be not afraid, over a hundred times. And each time it appears, it's a command. It's a directive statement. Don't be afraid. And the, there's always a because. Because the Lord will fight for you. The Lord is with you. So don't be afraid. And if you are afraid, then pray. Reach out to God. Seek Him. Ask Him to help you. And talk to somebody else who loves you, who knows the Lord, and who can pray with you and for you. And like I said, if you have any questions or things you'd like to know about what's in the Bible, then reach out to me and I will pray and ask God to show us.